What's up guys, my name is Xerity and welcome back to another video. Now before we actually get into the video, um, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and turn notifications on to be notified every time I upload an amazing video like this one. And today we are on Call of Duty World War 2. Uh, I am pumped for Black Ops 4 and I understand that is an unrelated topic uh, because we are actually on World War 2 right now, but I'm really excited for Black Ops 4 Zombies. And that also got me thinking I really want to play Zombies. And that also got me thinking that I wanted to play the very... Or brand new map or the new zombies map for call of duty world war 2 it came out i think yesterday on xbox one of course ps4 gets it 30 days earlier than xbox does um actually that's going to change after black ops 4 comes out because for black ops 4 um playstation is only going to get it seven days before us so only a week before xbox so i'll still be able to be make somewhat updated videos on the new dlcs and i honestly haven't even played the shadow throne yet but I'm probably just going to skip it because I want to check out this Frozen Dawn. So that's what we're going to be playing. Um, so you may be wondering why I'm in local play. And that is mainly because I literally just finished recording a Soul Calibur 6 beta video. I'm not sure if I'm able to get it up on YouTube or not. Because I was lagging really badly in the recording. And that is why I am on local play. Because I have a feeling that there are a lot of people on my Wi-Fi network. So we're going to play uh, for, or the Frozen Dawn on... Uh, whatever this game's called. I'm gonna go as uh, Marie or Mary. I don't even know. She's my favorite character. Uh, we will go with... We'll go for... Uh, we'll go for Camouflage. That's my favorite. Um, that's my favorite perk in, um, the Zombies. Now, I never really played the Zombies of this game mode that much. I played it when it first came out a little bit, but the first map, it got really boring. Although, I am going to admit that they did sledgehammer did a really good job for it being their first time making zombies they did a really good job designing the zombies all right well that's very interesting so we're here okay hold on all right wave one so it's just i guess this is basically just a normal zombies video i'm just gonna lay zombies because you know that's that's what people do when they do uh, gameplay commentaries pretty sure that's what they do just Correct, uh, comment down below and correct me if I'm wrong. So, I I had an idea for, um, what, uh, one of the, uh, Activision companies can do for, um, a Zombies game mode. They could kind of make it, like, kind of like what Black Ops 3 did with, um, uh, for, I think Nightmare Mode or whatever. It was basically the campaign, but with zombies instead of actual regular, um, human AIs. But I feel like they could have done way better with it, making a whole separate, like, campaign for zombies. Like, they could do, you know, um, Dempsey, Nikolai, Takio, and Richtofen. Um, the, basically, their story starting from, you know, when the zombie apocalypse first happened. And I don't really know the story with them. I never really followed, followed along with it, considering on how young I was when I first started playing Nazi zombies in World at War. But they could um, include every map that, you know, Nikolai and all them have ever been in and tell it like a story, kind of like a campaign. And of course, with it being zombies, they'll have to do it as co-op. Um, so we can uh, do one, one to four players. But I feel like that'd be a really cool um, idea. And actually, I've never really talked about this on the channel, but one of my, you know, favorite, or like one of the things that are, or a few of the things that I want to be when I grow up is, um, of course, a video game designer. I would love to make my own games and just develop them, you know, myself. Or I wanted to, like, obviously I wanted, I want to be a pro player, but I mean, I'm not that good. Like, I mean, but whatever happens, happens. And, uh, I also, one other, uh, another option that I had, or that I want, is, uh, to work at Activision, Infinity Ward, Treyarch, Sledgehammer, specific, preferably Treyarch, um, considering they still, or they do zombies and all that stuff, which I completely love. I mean, all the companies are good, just anything where I work on a Call of Duty game, which is, I would love to do, and that's even if Call of Duty's still around by the time I, I get old enough. So I don't even know where anything is, to be honest. Because I know there's like an underground thing. Grab that. Can't go out there. Um, yeah, I don't know. Huh. I don't know. I, don't know. I mean, it was a clown, but I don't understand, like, the Easter egg or anything. Do I have to kill, like, zombies on top of this thing? 
Because I know Black Ops 3 would have done that, so I would assume that they would do the same. So I'll wait for them to get on the platform, and bam. Bam. Ah, I shall be correct. All right, hold on, I just need to do a bit of, not necessarily training, but keeping them running in a circle. All right. Well, I did it. I gotta figure it out. So I would assume we're after a sword. <laughs> what is that thing? Whoa. It'd be cool because we're in ice caves if they like froze up and they were moving slow. Oh, Jesus. That is, that's just cool. I'm honestly just farming up points at this point. I already have it, okay. I guess we'll, no, no, we'll get this type 100. I just realized I have um, insta kill and I didn't even realize. Oh, speaking of which, um, comment down below if you guys would want me to do some more uh, multiplayer World War II videos before Black Ops 4 comes out. And that also reminds me, I, I did record two um, Blackout beta videos with Evan. If you don't know Evan, he used to be in um, one or a few of my old videos. And of course, you know, we're, we're still friends, of course. Well, speaking of which, he's my best friend, but... Uh, we did record two videos on the Blackout beta, but for some reason, they got corrupted and I couldn't edit them. The screen was all like glitched up and it was green, so I couldn't I couldn't edit it and or uh, I couldn't edit it and upload it. So unfortunately, I couldn't get any blackout gameplay out. But I will say that it was a lot of fun, and I will probably do, probably do a review video on it sooner or later. Just uh, putting some straight up gameplay, and of course, I'll take someone's gameplay and give them credit, and uh, I'll kind of voice over my opinions of the game and what you know the mode it. Or how good the mo I think the mode is so far. But yeah, just, um, like I was saying, just comment down below if you uh, would want me to do some more World War II multiplayer videos. Uh, maybe doing the new multiplayer maps before Black Ops 4 comes out. Because when Black Ops 4 comes out, even with it having Blackout, I'm done with World War II. Although I will come revisit it every now and then if they start adding more content and everything. Which actually, after I'm done this video, if I don't go to edit straight away, I'm probably going to go play some multiplayer. Um, but, open it! Jesus, I could have swore I held X in the first place. You know, you get the point. Or actually, no, I remember, okay. <laughs> so, once, uh, Blackout and Black Ops 4 comes out, I'll be done with World War II, although I will, uh, occasionally check in to check out the updates. And I will be done with Fortnite, although I will also occasionally check in for, to check out the new updates in Playgrounds or whatever, but I'm not actually gonna be playing it trying to get wins anymore. Uh, because, you know, Blackout will be out, and there's no point, because I'm a Call of Duty fan at heart. So, there's no point, you know, Fortnite can suck it when Black Ops 4 comes out. And I've even voiced my opinion, like, I don't think Fortnite's gonna completely die when Blackout comes out, but I feel like Blackout is gonna be the most competition that Fortnite has ever had, compared to what competition that they've had within the past year, with it being H1Z1, PUBG, um... You know, Realm Royale and all that. That was nothing compared to what Blackout and Battlefield 5 will be for Fortnite. Please, I need enough points. It's too many. I'm honestly, like, I probably missed so many power-ups <laughs> um, in the past rooms that I just ran past them and didn't get them because I was talking the whole time. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, if you could tell, I'm not good at zombies at all. <laughs> Anymore, at least. Okay, nice. I get a free use of the mystery box. The Proto X1, I actually haven't used this. I'm pretty sure this is like a multiplayer bonus or something. Ah. Oh. Bye. What does this do? Um, excuse me? Is that a teleporter? It is! That is actually brilliant. 
and rebuilt? Who were these people? Oh, so like kind of. Oh, I see. The blades are just. Yeah, what she said. Pulled you apart, put you back together. That's interesting. This Proto X One gun looks pretty cool. Now, actually, since we have a minute, let's take a look at this. Uh, this view. Wow. It's actually nice. Oh, can I fall down here? If I die, I swear. Really? Come on. I thought, like, you know how in Buried, when you first go down into the underground area, it's like that little slide? That's exactly what it looks like, and I thought that I could slide down it. Come on. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy, hit that like button. I would really appreciate it. Like and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one.